We're Alan and Saj, and we live full-time in our converted van, Apollo. After staying in one place for three months due to a coronavirus lockdown, we are finally free to travel. We are currently exploring the best of the UK and can't wait for international travel to start again. This week on Running Off Grid. Set. We're on the road. Feeling good. Feeling pumped. Just so excited to be here. We're at the beach. <laughs> I have a little hug. We're allowed to hug, so we're not for having us. Oh, it's been lovely. We we'll miss you. I know. You really looked after us. Set. We're on the road. Good. How are you feeling? Feeling good. Been pumped. Going okay, to Basingstoke Athletics Track for some running. I'm feeling weird. It's just so strange to be like working in the morning and then suddenly like sorting everything out, and now we're on the road, and then we're going to the track, and then I'm working later, and then we've got to find somewhere to sleep, and we don't know where that is. And yeah, it's fine, but it's a bit hectic. But that's what we signed up for: the nomadic life. Just the Instagram and say. That is, uh, that is the band line. <laughs> Here we are then. I remember, uh, remember it from last time, but the weather's very different when you did your 5k. Oh no, world's apart, isn't it? Yeah. Sweet, mate. Right, let's get running. I mean, we could just stay here, couldn't we? Yeah, what a gem. The running track. Lovely day. Free parking. It's flat. It's flat. There's loos. What else do you want? Hmm. How many times have you run on a track before, sir? Zero. 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 Which way round are you going to go? Oh yeah, which way round are you go? Oh, right. Yeah, I have got long legs. Alright then. So this way? Yeah. Don't go in the first two lanes, especially lane one. Enjoy. Ready? Ready? Go. It's so hot. Can't believe the sun after like winter for what feels like seven months. It's boiling. Blooming glorious. Yay for summer. Yay for running. Yay for van life. Alan Outbound back for his first session did brilliantly. Mm -hmm. And they're so high. Yeah, it's yeah, really high. high bed. It's kind of cool. I like it's it. a bunch of bed. Yeah, yeah. Need it for a lot of jumping. Yeah, right. I still haven't tried the shower out. <laughs> yeah, the shower goes on that panel. I mean, this, I'm so glad we got this, because this is cool. Like, cooking in the world. Really cool. We're really busy then. No. So, is this our, is this your first? Cooking van life meal for us both. So. Tasty. Sitting down on our uh, very own bench. Had me cook. How about your pitcher, Brad? Bloomy pepper yogurt. Hot sauce, spring onion. Boom. Look at that bad boy. Amazing. Take that, Jamie Oliver. Yeah, good, good van life cooking, bro. <sighs> 
What a cracking day. Sun's going down, spotlights are coming out on the track. Oh, what a good first day. So pleased it went well. And now we're going to put someone to bed down for the night, aren't we? Oh yes. Oh yes. Well, first 24 hours of van life, success. Had a good night. And uh, yeah, now we're off to no. 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 It's an absolutely beautiful industrial estate. It's lush. Of a journey, gorgeous. Knoll is an early Jacobean remodeling of the medieval Archbishop's Palace. Henry VIII famously hunted here and used it as a residence for his daughter, Mary I, during his divorce from Catherine of Aragon. In 1946, Knoll was gifted to the National Trust to be open to the public. The National Trust undertook a huge conservation project to rescue the house and its collections as they were falling into a serious state of disrepair. Because of coronavirus, the house was unfortunately not open. And anyway, we needed to track down some water because we were getting low in the van. What are you after, an outside tap? Yeah, we need some more water for the van. I'm just wondering if we can pinch a bit of water whilst we're here. But... We're looking for an outside tap, YouTube. An outside tap. Dog bowl. Dog bowl. Yeah. So they clearly do have an outside tap. He's missing a handle. The one handle of deer. Are you okay? Missing an antler there, buddy. Yeah. You wouldn't get this close to them in Bushy Park. What a nice day I'm having. Wait, right, I'll do a joke. Go. Okay. Alright, hang on. I'll pan across. Okay, pan across. And I'll do a joke. Do a joke. Go. Venison deer, isn't it? I don't feel that landed too well. Venison's deer, isn't it? <laughs> See? It's hilarious. I thought it's venison. It's deer, isn't it? Venison. It's deer, isn't it? There I mean, you, go. you could deliver it like that, yeah. You could set it however you want it. It's all in the delivery. Rude, Bit standoffish. Bit standoffish. That's birds for you there. Mum's found a cracking um, park for night space just outside Margate, so we're gonna head off there and see what it's like. Herm Bay. Herm Bay. Yeah. Oh. actually giving me tears in the eyes. <laughs> I've been in lockdown for way too long. <laughs> I'm like, the world, it's real. <laughs> I'm just so excited to be here and to just go for a little wander around and maybe have some chips on the beach. It's just, the world exists. Maybe three months in one place in a van has affected me more than I thought. <laughs> I'm 
I'm just like terrified how much it's going to cost when we come to come out of the car park. It'd be like 50 quid. <laughs> 50 quid a night. We're just so excited to be here. We're at the beach. I can't remember the last time I was at the beach. It does have a beach. <laughs> Beach is there, man. Look at the beach. Where are we? Herm Bay. Herm Bay. Herm Bay. <sighs> Mate, I just feel amazing. Oh, good. I didn't realise what it was like being in lockdown for so long. I'm just loving it. Also, well, you said we can have chips. Well, yeah. Let's have chips on the beach. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I need to calm down. <laughs> just calm down. Just chill. I also excited, but not not that excited. This is resting bitch face excited. <laughs> I'm smiling. Look at this smile. Come on, let's go explore. Let's go explore. See you girl. Which fish and chip place do you want to go to then? Ernie's place. Ernie's Ernie's place. Spelled P L A I C E. Yes. Oh, it's pretty good actually. So I think it was like. 20p per satchel, sachet, so I just got the whole thing because that was two pounds. So I think that's a bargain. Um, I also got. What's that? It's a, it's a gherkin. Pickled gherkin. Let me some mayo. Yummy! What a nice evening. We're back in the back of the van now, just literally on the seafront. You can't see that. There's the sea. We had a stroll along and saw everyone enjoying themselves and then we got some ice cream and ate it looking out into the sea. Literally a perfect day. One of the best days of my life. No, that sounds ridiculous, but it definitely was. And now for more expanse. <laughs> Say night YouTube. Good night YouTube. Good morning everyone. What a difference a night makes. Where's the sun gone? It's chilly, it's windy, it's everything you'd expect from the coast in the UK. That's for sure. Slept very well last night though, getting really used to uh, being in the van in different places now. It's awesome. Bit of a ruckus about 12 o'clock, but other than that, it seems like quite a nice place. I reckon once. <laughs> I reckon once the pubs are open though, it could be a bit, could be a bit leery on a Saturday night, you know, like a lot of coastal towns. Let's go and see if Saj is awake. Cold. I don't want to touch the metal. <laughs> what happened, man? Yesterday was so warm. Ha ha ha! 
Oh, did it go in the water? God, that didn't go in the in the water. <laughs> You're covered in shit. Yeah, I know. It's not happy, mate. Getting the worst of the first. Oh God, how bad is it? Yeah, it's quite bad. You got on my trousers. Welcome to Margate! <laughs> it's lovely! Margate in the spring. The tidal pool. Tidal pool. So I'm just going to go in now? Yeah, we're just going to go in, like for the top. Like for the brow. It's worth it, mate. Yeah, they will. Shout. Shout what? Go in. Go in. I've got van life hair going on today. Mm. Blurmer now. <laughs> Where we were parked um, in the other place, we got completely covered in seawater, and Alan was like, We can't have salt on Apollo plus the bird poo. So, um, we come to jet wash, and uh, Alan's giving her a good old, a good old go over on the jet wash. Boom. Thanks for watching, everyone. We're going to leave it here for this week. We will see you again on Sunday at 3 pm. If you like the channel, please consider subscribing or dropping us a comment, it really helps us out.